Welcome to Real Physics. This is a series of clips about great physicists and today I'm talking about Ludwig Boltzmann. Everyone knows the name because there is the Boltzmann constant. Not everyone has a constant of nature named after him. It is debatable whether K is really a constant of nature. I discussed that in this video because it kind of reflects the fact that temperature is nothing else that kinetic energy and that was discovered much earlier by Robert Meyer. However, it was Boltzmann who developed modern thermodynamics in a sophisticated way and defined statistically the concept of entropy. Entropy was first developed by Rudolf Clausius, but Boltzmann laid the correct mathematical statistical foundations for it in this famous formula relating it to the logarithm of microstates, and this remains his great achievement. Every physicist is also familiar with the Boltzmann factor, and it's very simple because if you consider two states, say two states of an atom that distinguish in energy, you can easily calculate the respective probabilities, the respective densities by just e to the power of minus difference in energy divided by k temperature, absolute temperature, of course. That's so fundamental, that's so everyday for a theoretical physicist. Einstein used it later in the derivation of Planck's law of thermal radiation. Yeah, he remains a great physicist. He was born in 1844, had a successful career, was professor in different places, in Graz, in Wien, in Munich, almost everywhere. He had five children, one of them died tragically at young age. And unfortunately, Boltzmann himself was mentally not stable. He had depressions and sadly in 1906, he took his own life. He committed suicide in this place here, in this beautiful place, Duino at the Adriatic coast. And certainly not a good place for that. Personally, I admit that theoretical thermodynamics is not even my personal fancy. I prefer intuitive physics, gravity. But it's so important that I also have tried to include it in variable speed of light theories. Not yet successful, but it's a tool that's used by every physicist and you must be familiar with. I forgot to mention also the law by Stefan and Boltzmann, two different physicists, a special case of Planck's law of thermal radiation. And yeah, Boltzmann remains always one of the great names in theoretical physics. Since I always invite critical voices, I would like to mention also this book about a critical view on the entire concept of entropy, but that does not take away anything of Boltzmann's legacy. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like it, and if you're interested in fundamental physics, subscribe to this channel.